Guys, I know the quality's not the same, but on this video, but I had to come and deliver this message. Now, real quick, we're speaking about the new earth, the rise of the divine masculine, the rise of the divine feminine. If you guys don't know what that is, the, div the divine masculine is a man who is in his purpose, who is taking care of himself, who is retaining his energy, who is being positive to all, who is connecting with his higher self, his highest version, his best version. And the same is for the divine feminine, her highest being. She is connecting with that. She is taking care of herself. These divine beings are coming forward more and more every single day. People are waking up every single day and connecting with their true power more and more as time goes on. This is the rise of the new earth. I want to give a special shout out to Spiritual Tony, my absolute bro. Makes a lot of great music, guys. Check him out specifically. He has a new song called New Earth, which gave me the inspiration to make this video in the first place. Guys, the rise of the new earth is so real, and you see it happening. Specifically, want to speak more about... I've actually never talked about this, but the whole Aiden Ross. The whole emasculating men uh, push on the internet gay jokes all the time coming out of nowhere i've got nothing wrong with anyone who wants to go whatever sort of way okay i have nothing wrong that's not what this video is about this video is about spiritual so speaking on aiden ross and coming at him for emasculating men for all of these 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 gay pranks that he would he would pull even though the man, from what I know, is not gay, okay? This is spreading gay tendencies towards the youth. And I, I don't want to sit here and say that I am against it. But I am. I am against it. This should not be happening. The divine masculine and the divine feminine are two separate genders. See, it's it's hard to speak on these topics, man. But one of the rules, one of the laws of the seven principles that I speak about on this channel is the law of gender. There is genders, male and female, okay? No, in my opinion, no one should be brought to be raised as they if if especially if they are a kid with a developing mind. This shouldn't be what the the this should not be happening. And you see guys, I'm sitting here stumbling over some of my words because social media and things are so adamant on everyone being so PC, politically correct all the time. Everyone you know, it's okay to be gay. It's okay for all this stuff. But at a certain point, there's a line that needs to be drawn. And what I'm saying is this new earth collective, the rise, the rise of the divine masculine and the divine feminine. You want to know a very fast way that you can become divinely masculine in your masculinity? You can become divine within your masculinity. Semen retention. It connects you to source. It connects you to God. It connects you to your purpose. These are all divinely masculine traits that people have. And many of us are going to start coming forward now. Many of us are going to start speaking our truth now. Whether it be female or, or male with a lot of love to give. And I might not necessarily know what this new earth, the rising of this new earth may be, but I do know that many are becoming awakened. That many of us are, 
awoke in 2020, right? Just like me. And many of us still have yet to awake. And it's very important that with this experience under my belt of following this practice, these, these various spiritual practices, taking care of myself, semen retention, exercising, eating right, loving myself, I'm now able to spread this message that hopefully can, can be reached by many people out there, guys. This is very important. I might not necessarily know where things are going. All I know is the energy is rising. And if you are not getting better slash learning from your mistakes at this point, I hope you wake up soon. Because something is big on the horizon that, that I feel there will be a split between potential people who have ignored their soul who have not listened to their intuition and who may have been blinded by society and 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 have this idea and they're so caught up in the world they're so caught up in the matrix those people they experience extreme suffering as the rise of energy on the earth happens and I can see the split. I can see the divine rising. And I can see the negative becoming more negative. And the weak becoming more weak. And it's sad to say. It's sad to say, but I've seen it with my own eyes. People around me, man. And I just hope that more and more people rise. I really do cuz you know I don't I don't want to see people fall down into that pit of anxiety and depression and ter- terrible feelings about themselves all because they never listen to their soul all because what they care about is material ass things all because is is they just want to be make money and they they think that that will make them happy they think that being in, getting married and having kids and getting the career and going down that path with the picket white fence and the house and the dog and the kids will make them happy and maybe it will but there's more than life to working a nine to five and going home and eating dinner with the family processed ass food there's more to life than that there's way more And you might sit there and say that they're learning their own lessons. Well, yeah, they are learning their own lessons. But I believe that the rise of this new earth is is something we've never seen before. And maybe that's why all of these disasters, all of these terrible things are happening. World War III, COVID, all of this stuff. It's because all of these old systems that are in place need to have destructive things happen to them before a new rise comes this is all just coming to my head right now guys i i feel i'm speaking from source and i hope this this message can resonate with you guys because i'm I'm actually just excited to listen back to to me talk this because sometimes when i get on these talks it just flows it just flows everything just flows i feel connected today guys Hope you have a great day. Take care of yourself.